Welcome to Mahjong Central. My name is Michelle. On this episode of Mahjong Nash and Such, I'm going to make peach mango salsa. This is half pantry, half fresh. If you have fresh ingredients, I'm sure it will be better, but I'm trying to use up some of my pantry ingredients. I have right here some mangoes that I got at Costco. They're in some kind of a simple syrup, so I rinsed them and then I'm draining them on paper towel. I have here also some uh, sliced peaches in simple syrup and I rinsed these and those have been draining here also. These have been draining for probably 15 minutes or so. You just want them to be as dry as possible. Then for the other ingredients here, uh, I have about a, a cup and a half of diced tomatoes. I have about a half a cup of yellow bell pepper. I have about a half a cup of diced red onion, two tables, or let's see, these are about two cloves of garlic minced. Then I have some jalapeno. This is one whole jalapeno with the, um, uh, that rind, what is that white stuff in there? I don't know what that's called, but I've hollowed out the seeds and scraped away the white so it's as mild as possible. So I've diced the jalapeno finely, and then I have some chopped cilantro. This is probably uh, maybe a two tablespoons or a tablespoon or so, heaping tablespoon of cilantro. And then I have a lime. I'm just gonna squirt in some lime juice. So all I'm going to do right now is dice up these peaches and mangoes. So I just want them to be small dices so that you can scoop it with a chip. I don't think I would want really big chunks in here. So I'm gonna dice it pretty thinly here. I think that's pretty good. Okay, so I'm just gonna scoop that into the bowl. And do the same thing with these mangoes. Okay, so I'm just going to put in the rest of these ingredients here. Let me get this out of the way. So we'll put in the tomato, the bell pepper, it's gonna be good. and then the onion and garlic, the cilantro, the jalapeno, and now I'm gonna squeeze in some of this juice. That's it. Now I'm gonna mix it up. And I think that if you leave it in the fridge for an hour or so, it would probably chill nicely in there and all those flavors would marry well. All right, there it is. Peach mango salsa. Let's taste it. I think this is something you can just throw together and eat right away. Let's hope. I've actually never had it before. It just looked really good to me. Okay. Here we go. Smells really fresh.
Mm, that's very good. When I think about salsa, I think about the tomato salsa, like paste picante or thick and chunky salsa, the tomato-y salsa. But this has a little bit of a bite because of the jalapeno, but a little bit of sweet because of the fruit. So it is really tasty. And I think it's a beautiful dish. Look at the colors in there. I think this would be really pretty on a mahjong spread. I think this recipe is a keeper. Mm-hmm. It's different in a good way. I think after it chills for a while, it probably would be even better. So I'd recommend chilling it for maybe an hour. But I think it's delicious. And I think, again, it would be really good served for an accompaniment with any kind of a protein like chicken, pork, and um, maybe fish. I was afraid that the garlic might be too much, you know, that you might bite into a piece of that minced garlic. But it's not bad at all. I mean, I, I didn't get any overwhelming flavor of anything. All these ingredients, the onion, the garlic, the tomato, the peach, and the mango, they just kind of balance each other out and not any one thing stands out. Maybe I would pull back on the red onion a little bit next time, but I think this is a great recipe. I'm going to put this in a smaller bowl. Wow, that barely fit in there. Hey, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So I think that would be a lovely snack to offer your Mahjong friends. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, click subscribe. Then click that bell so you get notification for when I post new videos. That way you won't miss out on any recipes that might be good at your next Mahjong event. Between now and the next episode of Mahjong Nosh and Such, may all your picks be keepers. I'm just going to have a little smell. Oh, so good. Fresh. And pretty.